Alrighty guys, so I just, uh, if you saw my last video, I was going to do one about uh, using AI to negotiate with a broker on a load. Uh, I asked, what was the question I asked? Um, can you write me a script for a carrier calling a freight broker and negotiating a load? That's what I asked, chat GPT. I mean, let's go through it. Introduction. Hi there. This is... Stuart uh, from Patriot Star. Uh, I'm calling about a load that I see a brokerage has posted on the load board. Can you give me some details about the load? Obviously, they're going to tell you some more stuff about it. Um, qualifying. Great, thank you. I'm interested in learning more about the load's origin destination. It could be who's the ship, who is the shipper, you know, uh, stuff like that, uh, and any special requirements. Additionally, I'd like to know what your brokerage typically pays for this load. Now, I personally wouldn't ask that question. I wouldn't ask that question at, at this point. Um, that, that's just me. But this is what the, you know, it's it, it's a bit of a generic script here, right? Identifying pain points. I see. Well, I appreciate the information. Based on my experience, I know that this particular route can be challenging due to traffic and other factors. Uh, can you tell me if your brokerage has had, has had any issues with this route in the past. Now, I like that. I do like that because now we're not, I would take the money bit out in the first bit and I would probably ask this question first because now we're we're making ourselves different from someone else, right? Because everyone asks about the money. Everyone wants to, how much does it pay? How much does it pay? But if you actually show that you care a little bit, you'll be amazed how much more of a, a response you'll get from brokers because it throws them off kilda right everyone asks them money so their responses are based around money so now you've come at it from a different angle and you'll catch them on the back foot that's just the way i look at it um offering solutions understand well i'm confident my team and i can handle this load with efficiency and care in fact we have experience with this route and have a proven track record of timely and safe deliveries. Given our experience and expertise, would your broker be willing to negotiate the rate for this load? Okay, so but you've let them set the anchor at the beginning with this script, and now you're coming back around, coming back around and trying to negotiate here. It's, it's, a, different, it's a different tactic, I guess. Uh, thank you for considering my proposal. Uh, can we discuss dispension? Can we discuss potential rates for this load? I believe that we have we can reach a mutual a mutual beneficial agreement that works for both of our business. How does a rate of your proposed your my proposed rates or whatever sound to you? Thank you for your time, and I look forward to welcoming you and your brokerage on this load. Okay, I would skip that out. You're gonna wait for a response over slow, obviously if you're on the phone. Um, what do I think about this? I think it's a good st structure. I think there's a good structure here. I think there's definitely some areas that we could base it more around a phone call uh, as far as, you know, I just think there's a better, maybe re reorder it. Uh, I like some of the questions that it's asking and the way they approach some of the challenges. Uh, I'm definitely going to give it a shot. I'm going to give it a shot and put it in my words, how I would word it. Qualifying. Great, thank you. I'm interested in learning more about the load's origin. I would say where the load's picking up. Is it a distribution center, blah, 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 you know? Is it a, a smaller location? Any special requirements? Okay, does it need any pad wrap? Does it need straps, load bars? Um, additionally, I'd like also, Instead of it, I would never use the word additionally. I'd always say also. I'd also like to know what what do, what do, what are you typically typically be moving these for? What, and the script says are typically. Well, I additionally, I'd like to know what your broker typically pays for this load. You know, I might ask that question. I'd like to know what what what, what are you what are you trying to move it for? Two thousand dollars. Okay, yeah, I see on the uh, on the DAT board that's a little bit below the 15-day average. Uh, okay, uh, I see. Well, I appreciate the information, uh, but based off my experience, I know there can be a, there can be a lot of issues with traffic. Uh, 
know, I know sometimes that shipper has long detention time, stuff like that. Um, have you guys ever experienced issues with this customer before? Uh, anything with the route, stuff like that? Is that, you know, is it something that you've ever experienced? No, no, it's, all, it's, in, and, it's in and out, it's in and out. Um, <coughs> excuse me, that's what they always say, in and out. Okay, okay, uh, well, I know from my experience, I'm pretty confident I can I, I can get this handled for you. Uh, the, you know, I've got the hours, I've got the equipment, uh, and uh, we've been around. You know, you can definitely uh, entrust this load with us. Uh, would Would you be willing to move a little bit on that rate? No, that's all we got in it. Well. I, I can appreciate that. I can appreciate that's all you've got in it. Uh, but for us to do it, uh, I'd really need to, you know, I'd really need a couple of extra hundred bucks or, you know, an extra $500 for this load to, to make sense for, for, for us. Uh, you know, with our experience and the equipment involved and the time involved with this, uh, you know, especially knowing with this shipper, you know, and, and receiver sometimes have some extensive layovers or detention times, I, I think XYZ rate would be better. I don't know. I don't know. I would tweak it. I would tweak it. I would, you know, it's very generic, but I think it gives a good, you know, idea of where we should be going with it. Oh no, give it a shot guys, see what happens. We're just playing around here, right? You know, experimenting. See if it helps. Anyway, catch you in the next one.